Karen Parsons, who's best known for being on the Fresh Prince of Bel-Air, talked about her nonprofit, Sweet Blackberry. And it tells little known stories of black history, like Garrett Morgan, who invented the traffic light, and Bessie Coleman, the first African-American woman to earn her pilot license. These stories are narrated by stars such as Lawrence Fishburne, Chris Rock, Queen Latifah, and Alfre Woodard. The conversation was hosted by NKU Associate Professor Dr. David Childs. Parsons hopes her organization can inspire kids and to empower them to read. I think representation is important. I think when you see someone that looks like you, who did something wonderful and made great contributions, you recognize, hey, I, that, I could do that. that. That person looks like me, you know, and you, you lean into it as opposed to feeling outside and like um, somebody who's not seen, not regarded, or not valued. If you don't know how to read, it's kind of challenging using, because we use reading in our everyday lives at John B. Parker. I had the honor of being mistress of ceremonies, and before the discussion, the event had food and a live DJ. There were about 15 local vendors made up of local authors and educators who were handing out free books to families. Brown Hands Literacy, Rising Stars of America, Annie Ruth and the Madisonville Education and Assistance Center are just to name a few of them. And at 9 o'clock on Local 12, you will hear from a local student who's going to college for free, all thanks to scholar Marion Spencer. She's among of, what, dozens of students that got free scholarships, yeah. scholarships to go to UC. I know, so. we got to meet a couple of them last week when yeah. they had the press conference at UC, but there are some others, and I can't wait to hear yes. more from them. Yeah, Marion Spencer was just a wonderful a person. Of course. Mm -hmm. She was, yeah, lucky to have her. Mm -hmm. You can always find our stories here on YouTube, but go ahead and tap subscribe. That way you're always in the know.